Wow, everything on HI2 is so detailed and pretty, but it's taking me forever to move. Let's take a look at some ways that we can speed up gameplay. First, it's important to understand a little about how the game runs. HI2 is played in your internet browser using a plugin called Flash Player. Flash does not load all content of the game at once. Rather, it focuses first on loading the content you want to use. So, I'm standing on Amber Sands Isle now. The Flash player is working on loading the information about Amber Sands. It's not concerned about, oh, Plains Isle now. But take a look around. This is a big aisle. I'm going to zoom out more so that you can see all of the detail that's in here, like NPC houses, trees, rocks. All of this is information that the game has to load. Plus, you can see as I go into my settings that the game is also loading all shadows and effects. All of this is just a lot of information for the game to handle at one time, causing lagged game performance, which you saw earlier when I tried to move around and it was very slow. And now you're also going to see that it takes longer between the time that I click on something and the time that the button pops up. Fortunately, there are ways to reduce lag and improve game performance. Our barometer for performance is going to be this little number in the right-hand corner of the toolbar. This number represents my FPS, which stands for frames per second. That's a measure of how fast Flash is loading the game. Higher numbers mean a faster speed. Many players average between 9 and 15. Some get more, others less. FPS varies by how much information the game needs to load, so on big aisles with lots of content, like Amber Sands, you'll probably have a lower FPS than a smaller, more barren aisle like Flurry, and that's totally normal. You'll also notice that when I enter a building, my FPS goes up. That's because there's less to load in this tiny little space than there is on all of Amber Sands Isle. The first thing I'm going to do to optimize my game's performance is to close out all other windows that use Flash. To put it in human terms, if you're watching, oh, three YouTube videos and playing Horse Isle 1 and listening to internet streaming radio, your Flash player is just multitasking way too much to concentrate on HI2. If I were downloading any big files, like music, that would also slow the game. I'm going to go ahead and close out of all of those windows that I'm not really using. And look, you saw my FPS shot up to 8, and now it's hovering around 5. That's still an increase from the 3 to 4 that I was getting earlier. You can see I'm moving a little faster, and there's less lag between the time that I click on something and the time that the button pops up. If that doesn't completely banish your lag, you can increase game performance by changing your settings. First, I'm going to hide shadows and effects. That removes any weather detail that I might have had, like the rain or clouds that you might see on some aisles, and the shadows underneath objects, like the rocks, have also disappeared. If you've watched the other videos, you'll know that I hide shadows and effects most of the time. For me, that's the best way to optimize my game's performance on my computer. If you want to further reduce lag, you can click Lower Art Detail. I'm going to reconnect real fast to take a look at what that just did. And we're back. Not quite so pretty now, but my FPS increased. I'm now hovering around 7 or 8 instead of 5 or 6. Let's take a look at low quality, too, while we're at it you can see that the buttons just got a whole lot more pixelated. Everything is a little less crisp now, but again, my FPS went up, hovering around 8 or 9 instead of 7 or 8. Still not good enough? We can try hiding the mini-map, compass, and border. Looks a lot different. Again, FPS went up. It's 9 or 10 now instead of 8 or 9. All of what we just did, hiding the compass, minimap, and border, gave the game less to load. Now we're playing a stripped-down HI2, lacking detail and prettiness, but look at the FPS. Test out a bunch of graphics settings to see how they affect your computer's performance. You can try mixing and matching the options I showed here. 
you should be able to find a combination that works well for you. Still not working? If you've tried all of the suggestions that we just talked about and you've checked the help files and made sure that com your computer meets or exceeds the technical requirements needed to play the game and your game is still slow below 4 FPS something like that that means that you can't walk quickly there's one other option which is trying a new browser many players find that the game runs faster in Firefox or Google Chrome than Internet Explorer both of these browsers are safe and free to download from their manufacturers if you're using Linux it is especially recommended that you use Firefox keep playing around with ways to reduce lag and see what works for you